For more of Gamers Cast reviews, you can head on over to gamerscastpodcast.com slash reviews. Hey everyone, this is Matthew Golden from Gamers Cast. Here is my review of Sonic the Hedgehog 2 for the Nintendo Wii Virtual Console, now available for 800 Wii points. Sonic the Hedgehog 2 was originally released for the Genesis almost, well, about 15 years ago, actually. It was the sequel to one of the best platforming games ever to rival Mario. And, as I say, the sequel is a lot better than the original. The graphics, you can tell, the shading's a bit better, everything graphically is a big step up. Though, at first, it may look very similar to the first one, because essentially it is very similar. But there's actually a lot going on here. There's more depth to the levels, there's... There are more levels, there's more boss battles, and now there's a two-player mode. But now, but now, here comes the, the second new guy to the Sonic crew is introduced here. This is Miles Tails Prowler. He is generally just follows Sonic around through single-player mode. But after talking through, you know, through option screens, you can take control of Miles yourself. But... He controls very similarly to Sonic, and the only real difference is he gets to hover with his tails. You don't really have much control over this. That's an innovation left for Sonic the Hedgehog 3. I'll be reviewing that one soon as well. And, and the two-player mode is a great innovation as well, as you generally have the screen split horizontally into two sides. And one player takes control of Sonic, while a friend takes control of Tails, and you race through the level to see who gets to the, fin- to the finish line the quickest. And the winner is based of the match is based on the time, on how many rings you have, and how many lives you have left, etc., etc. And it goes to best three out of five. There's loads of new features here, including Sonic's signature new spin dash move, which is done by crouching down and quickly tapping B to shoot out in a giant blast of speed. All in all, this is a very solid sequel. The gameplay is improved. The presentations review uh, improved. And there's even a few more unlockables than last time. It's a great title, and if you haven't picked it up in several hundred ways before, or have never seen it or played it before, now's a great time to do it. 800 V points isn't much of an action asking price. But just be aware, this game is also available on the Game Gear, the Master System, lots of in lots of plug and play forms for cell phones and for the 360. So just make sure you don't have this somewhere else already. And so Sonic the Hedgehog 2 gets a 9 out of 10.